I'm sitting here reading through our Bible study on 1 John. I am loved by Wendy Blight. And I'm in uh, week three. And our, our Bible verse today that we we're memorizing this week is um, 1 John 3, 1. And for some reason, it's just uh, bringing me to tears today. This verse is, Consider the kind of extravagant love the Father has lavished on us. Mm. He calls us children of God. It's true. We are His beloved children. That's the verse. Consider the kind of extravagant love the Father has lavished on us. Hmm. Consider it. What is it? What kind of love? What is this love that our Father has given to us through His Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord? 1 Corinthians 13 gives us an example of what the type of love is that God gives us. In verses 4 through 8, he describes the character of God's love. And he describes it as being patient, kind, unselfish, protective. It describes it as being unfailing. That's what I pull out of there. And, and when I think about the kind of love that the Father has shown to me through his patience, he has been patient with me and all the times that I have wandered astray, trying to figure things out on my own without reaching out to him, without trusting him. He is patient and he waits for me to come to that point where I realize I can't do this on my own. I can't live this life without his guidance. He is kind. He's gentle. His voice is soft and it reminds me of, wait, just hold on, just hold on my child and, and, and I've got this. I've got this. I am kind, I am loving. I know what you need. Just trust me. He protects us. So many times you hear people saying, God will not give you more than he can handle, more than you can handle. But I just, and, and it says that in his word, but it also continues to say that because when it gets to the point to where we are beyond what we can carry, we know, I can't take it anymore. You ever been there and you just say, I can't, I cannot do this. What happens? God takes it. He won't give us more than we can handle because it is at that point in our lives that he says, hand it over to me and let me carry this burden for you. God is unfailing. His love does not fail. He is consistent. He is constant. He is the same yesterday, today, and forever. And when all else fails, when everything seems to be falling down around you, Jesus does not fail. He will be there to pick you up, to carry you. So let me say this again, our memory verse for this week, 1 John 3, 1, consider the kind of extravagant love the Father has lavished on us. He's called us children of God. It's true. We are his beloved children. <sighs>